Hello students, in this session we will solve sum number 3. Okay, it's very similar to question number 2 only. So now this term, we will first solve this particular term and then we will do this term and then we will merge the answers and we will get the value. Now, the first thing we will do is we will solve this one 7m minus 8n whole square. So in place of a, we have 7m in place of b, we have 8n and we will follow and we will apply which identity? That is a minus b whole square, isn't it? So a square minus 2ab plus b square. So let's solve this. Now in place of a, what, what is there? 7m. So we will do 7m whole square. 2ab means 2 into 7m into 8n plus what is b? 8n. So we will do the square of 8n whole square. So 7m into 7m is 49m square. If you multiply this, then the answer would be 112mn and this would be 64n square. So the solution of 7m minus 18 whole square is this one. Now we'll solve this one, students. That is 7m plus 8n whole square. So for this, for this which which identity will follow? Yes, a plus b whole square, that is a square plus 2ab plus b square, isn't it? We will follow this identity. So, we will mark this also in the side the box. Now, a is 7m and b is 8n. Very similar, just only the, the application has, identity has changed a bit. So, this 7m whole square plus 2 into 7m into 8n plus 8n whole square, isn't it? Now, the answer would be 49m square. This will be 112mn and this will be 64n square. Now, we'll solve this. Sum that is 7m minus 8n whole square. And then again, we have to plus plus 7m plus 8n whole square okay now in place of this we will write this one that is 49 m square minus 112 mn plus 64 n square we will put it inside the bracket plus this one 49 m square plus 112 mn plus 64 n square okay now we'll open the bracket after op opening the bracket we'll get the final answer plus 64 n square plus again we'll open this bracket also because now outside the bracket we have plus sign so no sign will change mn plus 64 n square now this two will be cancelled Okay, because when you solve this, you will get 0. Now, 49m square plus 49m square is what? It would be 98m square and 64m square plus 64m square is 128m square. So, this is your final answer. Okay, so this is the solution of sum number 3. Okay, now sum number 4, try it on yourself. Okay, all of you do it on yourself. This is very, very similar. Okay. And submit. So, as uh, most of the students have already submitted sum number 1 and sum number 2. So, uh, now those who have already done sum number 1 and sum number 2, they will complete sum number 3 and sum number 4 also. And those who have not done sum number 1 and 2, they will submit together. That is sum number 1, 2, 3 and 4. Okay.